What's up guys, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and if you may or may not know, the full version of Call of Duty Modern Warfare is now released. I pre-ordered the game, hurriedly installed it and hit the play button expecting to be dropped into the main menu, but I got an error message, something along the lines of I needed to update my graphics drivers, so I did that, restarted my PC, hit the play button yet again, and it opened. But on the wrong screen, at the wrong resolution, my PC froze. After a quick restart, I tried again, and I was greeted with an error message this time, saying something about Dev Error DirectX encountered an unrecoverable error. So I thought, what the hell is this? What could be causing it? And apparently there's no fixes on the internet, so I had to think about a solution, and luckily I've actually found one. So if your game is turning up on the wrong monitor, or it's doing something completely different, it's breaking on startup, then this is probably the easiest way to fix it. Just of course make sure that your drivers are up to date, Windows is up to date, etc, etc, before you go into trying this next step of the solution. So assuming you've done all of that and you're still pulling your hair out, wondering why Call of Duty Modern Warfare isn't starting, well then simply hit Start E to open up an Explorer window, head into Documents, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, and then you'll see these files over here. So they're a bit different with the full release of the game, however these files are from the Modern Warfare beta and not the full release. So the settings inside of here and their config and the player's config over here is a little bit different and it seems to be a bit broken at least trying to launch it in its current state. So there's two things that you can do, you can either delete these or you can go ahead and rename them to something that's not players or players2. So I'll just add hyphen all to the end of players2 and hyphen all to the end of players, and then simply you can just head across to your Blizzard launcher yet again. Don't have to restart it, don't have to do anything special, just hit the play button and you'll see the game should launch up as normal, or at least how it should. Of course all of your graphic settings and things like that will be reset, so you'll need to go ahead and redo them. If you have errors again, you can just delete the new players folder, and then hit play as usual. If you're still having errors at this point, you can go ahead and delete the players folder yet again. And inside of the Blizzard launcher, when you hit play, you can simply hit yes when asked about safe mode. This should launch the game up in a state that you can go into the options menu and change the settings. So let's go ahead and do that. And there we have it. We're now on the main menu of the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So I was having a couple more issues that I'll quickly touch on now. If you have multiple graphics cards in your system and it's launching on the wrong screen and it's breaking because of that, then there's a super simple way to fix that that may not be that obvious. Simply double click on players and go to your config.cfg. Open it with something like notepad and you'll see a list of files like this. So scrolling down to the very bottom, you might see Nvidia GTX followed by your graphics card, etc, etc. But this is not what we're looking for. You can see I've got a 1080 Ti and an NVIDIA GeForce 1080 installed. So let's quickly scroll up and you'll see that it's picking the graphics card up here. So originally before this was a GTX 1080, it was launching on the wrong screen at the wrong resolution. And because of that, it was crashing with that DirectX unrecoverable error. All I had to do was simply add space Ti inside of the inverted commas. Make sure it's spelled the same as it is down here on detected graphics cards save and launch the game again. Then it's basically working as normal. I can accept these terms of service and go ahead and set up my Modern Warfare for me to play. So that's about it. I hope it helps you. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoots and I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.